Hey guys, Adrian here for the Digital Dojos, and today I have a Windows tutorial for you guys on an application called Disk Space Fan. So, your hard drive's full, and you want to know what's taking up all those gigabytes and gigabytes of storage on your hard drive. You want to do some cleaning out of files, old files, you want to see what games, what videos, what music files, you know, whatever folder is taking up the most space, whatever, you know, what files in your system are, you know, uh, that you've accumulated over time that are taking up all that space. Well, you can obviously go through and uninstall programs and look through, but this makes it all the much more easier. It's a new way to explore your disk space usage. It's called Disk Space Fan. What it does is it analyzes your hard drive and visually represents to you what's taking up space. You know how much in terms of you know a uh, visual chart here you can see here. Uh, very easy, sorts it all out in uh, color codes and all all that stuff. So it's a fantastic visualization as you can see here. It's 100% free. It finds useless files easily, and it's integrated with the whole Windows Explorer interface, so it's easy to browse, open the folder, and delete those files that are taking up space. So go ahead over to the site at diskspacefan.com. I'll leave a link in the video description below. Go ahead and give it a download. Once you get done with that, the application itself is going to look something like this. It's going to show all the hard drives that you have listed. Uh, I think it even does external hard drives. So for example, this is the image drive, which comes with the factory, uh, what do you call that, uh, the manufacturer's um, partition for your hard drive. This is my main drive for the compact PC I'm on right now. It shows the capacity of the hard drive. So this is a 500 gigabyte hard drive, but some space is reserved for the operating system. Um, and then it shows the usage, how much you're actually using of the hard drive. So I'm using 288, 266 gigs, sorry. And I'm using, or I have 188 gigs free. So you can see that. Now I'm gonna go ahead and hit the scan button. And what this is gonna do, it's gonna scan through all my files and it's gonna uh, plot out a chart here to show me which of those files all are on my hard drive. It's going to analyze my whole hard drive. So this may take you know one or to five minutes depending on how many uh, you know how much hard drive space you have and how big your files are. So I'm going to go ahead and let this scan through and I'll get back to you once it's done. All right, so my scan's complete and as you can see here, it shows you the 262 gigabytes of data use here so if I hover over it it gives me some data about this the local disk and how many files folders etc and it gives me here a key of what the top list of files are being used program files files stored for Windows program data files uh, sy system files and stuff like that and of course others so you can see here 250 15 gigs which is the main uh, stuff that's taking up my storage is user items so stuff that I've downloaded and installed etc so if I was to go ahead and click on something like uh, for example, let's see, they have you know multiple folders here. You can see app data. You can see all the stuff that's taking up space. And not only that, it shows you how many gigs the actual uh, folder is taking up. So you can see my app data folder is taking up a lot. Uh, my Apple, it looks like Apple computer here. Uh, my system folder, which is all the system files, obviously. Uh, my desktop. So if I was to click on any of these, so for example, I'll click on, this is like a pretty big chunk here, videos. From there, I'm going to click on it, and it's going to do this little fancy, uh, as you can see, they did a little fancy uh, transition. And all within that, it shows you all of my videos are taking up space. So all these are one gigabyte files. You can see there, this whole folder in general is taking up 85 gigs on my hard drive, so I may want to remove some of the stuff. So uh, you can see here, let's say I want to remove one of these uh, search and destroy games that I used to play from, my, this is when I recorded Modern Warfare, and it shows you here a key on the side too. It shows you how much that is actually taking up space by itself. And if I click it, it should go back. Okay, so it's going to go back. And if I actually, right, sorry, here, right click it, I can open it, I can browse it, I can uh, go to the root, which would actually be uh, the same thing as going back to the main menu here. So, yeah, like I said, all the keys right here, you can also use the key to navigate if you want. But, um, like I said, you can just click into these files, and from these files, you can simply right click and open it and I'll open it in Windows Explorer and it's opening on here on my other monitor and if I pull over here to my other monitor or sorry pull the window over I should say from my other monitor you can see here that the videos folder has opened up and I can go ahead and delete that specific file or whatever it is it may be that I need to delete so guys this is a really really simple quick way to delete files are taking up your hard drive it visually represents which files are taking up all that space it shows you gives you the information you can even right click and go to properties and it should open up the properties for that specific folder so you can see here my movie folder where all my movies are stored on it's taking up 27 gigs so that's something that's definitely taking up a lot of space on my hard drive so i can you know check from there it's it has all those windows explorer properties here from when you right click 
so you can check it out. You can even delete it right from the application. So do check this guy, uh, this app out, guys, for you Windows users who have hard drive space that's maybe running full. You know you're running on the limit. Uh, check it out because it really is something that can help you when you can actually visually see your data and what's taking up space in terms of charts um, and chunks of you know data that are taking it up. Do check it out, guys. It's a free download. Again, Disk Space Fan for you Windows users. Uh, and again, guys, uh, don't forget to comment on the video, rate the video, you know, thumbs up, thumbs down, whatever you, uh, you know, your opinion is on the video. And of course, subscribe if you're not subscribed to the Digital Dojo's channel. Check out our website and sign up at YouTube, or I should say, www.com slash, or www.digitaldojos.com. All right, and before I make up any more mistakes here, guys, I'm going to go ahead and end the video. I want to say thanks for watching. I'll catch you guys in the next tutorial. Look forward to more tutorials coming up soon, guys. I'm coming up on winter break, and I'll have a lot more stuff coming from you, along with Duncan. I'm sure Duncan and Nuna will be coming with the winter break to get you guys some more videos. So thanks for watching.